Alright guys, so let's spruce up this trailer. Uh, first thing, we're going to blow out maybe the a foot or two into the trailer, make sure it's all clean on this hinge and stuff and on the door. Um, we're going to blow it out and then we're going to put this Thompson's water seal on the, uh, on the ramp and a few inches a few inches into the trailer right here so like if you know if the rain blows in a little bit so let's get to it two-step process get you a paintbrush that you don't really care about like get the cheapest one because this is waterproof or so it'll your paintbrush is ruined after you use it with this so like I said, I'm going to do a few inches in and then just work my way back so I don't walk on where I just did and then let it dry overnight or so. And uh, it'll be great. Brandon, Brandon's lawn care, my buddy. Shout out to Eclipse Lawn Care too, because that's right. I seen him do that. I was like, that's pretty cool. <laughs> so, let's do a little bit in the side door too. Let's blow this out. And, uh, you know, put maybe a few inches here. That way, if I'm working and it's raining and I have the doors open, you know, little bits treated right here. You know, where it can get wet. And then, you know, in the back too, so do it. Alright guys, another quick thing I do is I use this poster board and you can fold it up if you need to or whatever. And you can come along here and like set it in here on the wood when you're when you're spray painting or you know put it around the wheel when you're painting this black or this wheel well. You know, and I'm gonna hold it like see over these reflective parts. Right here I'm gonna like hold it like this and boom, spray it. Um just a much easier, faster way than taping. And I'm gonna try to hold it like in a circle and this rim. You know, to paint the white, I don't know if that's going to work. I kind of feel like it's not going to, but I'm going to try. I'm going to try to, like, put it right in the bead of the rim all around like that. You know, and spray it. So, anyway, let's get to it.
Hi. Get your GoPro, Rivy. He likes it because I turn on. Alright, guys. So, I got the old license plate from the, um, from the other owner. And so, and I already got my new license plate, so I'm gonna, I told him I would cut this up and dispose of it properly. Anyway, so what I'm gonna do is I bent it to the right, you know, to the right, uh, bend. Go right here on the tire bead like that. And you just spray little sections and work your way around the tire. That's what I'm gonna do. Alright boys, check this out. It's uh hot here in Georgia as you can see look at my shirt. And uh got the wheels. Let's do a quick walk around. It's not perfect by any means, but man it looks a lot better. Um doesn't even look like the same trailer. So you can buy these trailers used that are kind of rough like this. And uh, paint them up and just clean them up, paint them up. And uh, that's where my dad fixed the gate, which I'm very appreciative to him. We, we put a little piece of metal and welded it all on the back, and it, that's good to go. Um, you see, I got all this painted. Um, quick round of white on there. A little bit of mist on the tire on both sides, but um, it's pretty good. And I think, you know, over time that paint will come off of the rubber. I hope. But um, anyway. This looks great as you can see guys it looks it looks nothing the same as it did so i hope you guys like my trailer spruce up video we'll talk to you later oh yeah one other thing i want to do is that jack is so ugly like that i was planning on not painting this jack just because i don't know but Right here, live time. Let's go and paint this jack. It looks better. Get the back over here a little bit. Paint this part. I think we're good to go boys really think so so y'all having a great day see you later alligator hope y'all are staying cool out there because i know i'm not <laughs> all right guys here's the uh the can of uh, paint that i used um it's krylon rust protector satin enamel drives in eight minutes whatever um, as you can tell, it's dark out here because it looks like it might rain any minute. It is 742, but... Alright, boys. Just want to show you what paint I used. I think it was about 4 bucks, maybe. Walmart, I think. Got a couple of these, so... Let's get at it. 